Hey, Andy from Postaga here. Today, I'm gonna to teach you how to do the skyscraper technique in just a few minutes. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through this link building technique and show you how it's done so that you can more easily improve your search rankings and drive traffic to your website. And with the tools I'm gonna to show you today, it only takes a few minutes to do this entire process. So, if you're not familiar, the skyscraper technique is a method of link building with the ultimate goal of getting other websites to link to your content. And in turn, that is going to help your website rank better and get you found in search results. For the skyscraper technique, we're going to be using two different tools. The first is Ahrefs, which is a popular SEO keyword research tool and also Postaga, which is an all-in-one link building outreach platform. And I'm going to share links to them in the video description below. So stick around and in just a few minutes, I'll show you how you can easily get more links, improve your search rankings, and drive more traffic to your website. Let's do it. So real quickly, here is an overview of what the skyscraper technique is and how it works. So basically the goal of the skyscraper technique is to find an article that is ranking very well for a given topic and has many links pointing to it. Then we're going to find those websites that are linking to that article and reach out to them to get them to link to your content instead. So the main thing that you need is a piece of content that is better than that other content. You also need uh, research tools, we're gonna to be using Ahrefs, to find the websites that are linking to the current top ranking article. And then you need a tool to help you find the right email addresses for people at these websites and uh, build and send an email outreach campaign to them. And for that, we're gonna be using Postaga. Now, for the example that I'm gonna be using today, I'm taking a real example of a website submitted on our Facebook group. That's Grow Together SEO Link Building and Outreach. I recommend checking it out. It's all about link building, SEO, and outreach, and we're sharing different strategies and talking about link building campaigns. And we got a submission from Marco from the group with his article on the ultimate moving abroad checklist and step-by-step -step guide. Now this is a really good piece of content that breaks down how to move abroad. And it's very long, which is good and important because one key thing with a uh, skyscraper technique is you really want your content to be very good because you need to give people a reason to swap their link from another website to your website. And if your content isn't better than what they're already linking to, then there's really little chance that you're going to get that link. So I've got this article here from Marco's website, Nomadic Fire. It's all about moving abroad and the step-by-step -step process. Now, sometimes with uh, skyscraper outreach, you might first start with your research in Ahrefs. But here we're gonna start from the opposite end where we already have a piece of content. And then we're going to go to Ahrefs. We can go to either the Keyword Explorer tool or Content Explorer, but I'm gonna go here and search for the term moving abroad. And with this, I'm going to see information about this keyword and what articles are ranking. So if I scroll down, I can see what articles in particular are ranking well, but important for us are the backlinks. So an article like this one over here, I can see it has 106 different backlinks to it. That's great because what I'm going to ultimately do is try and reach out to each of these websites that is linking to this article and get them to link to my article instead. So in Ahrefs, I'm going to click this number next to the, uh, under the backlink column, and it's gonna break down for me all of the websites that are linking to this article. And I'm going to want to then reach out to these different articles to pitch them to link to my article on moving abroad. So the next thing that we're gonna do 
is we are going to click the export button and that is going to export these backlinks to a CSV file. And once I've exported that CSV and downloaded it to my computer, I'm going to open up my Postaga account. Now, Postaga is a link building outreach tool that helps you find relevant websites to reach out to, uh, get their contact details and find the right contact person, and then build and send outreach email sequences to them that are automated, but also customizable and personalized for each recipient. So Postaga has a lot of different campaign types to choose from, not just meant for Skyscraper, but in this instance, I'm gonna just create a new campaign and click on the Skyscraper campaign type. Then I'm gonna scroll down and I'm going to upload the CSV file that I exported from Ahrefs. And now I've imported that CSV spreadsheet into Postaga and I need to find the uh, referring page URL, and that's gonna be relevant for us for doing this campaign. So now I've pulled in all of the URLs of the websites that I'm going to be reaching out to. Next, I'm going to click Analyze Links, and then Postaga is going to analyze each one of these URLs and try and find the name of the ideal contact person at these websites. Typically, it's going to be the author of the blog post that wrote the article that uh, is linking to this competitor that we want to link to us instead. Um, but if not, finding the author of the post, trying to find a contact that is in a content or marketing position, or uh, if not those, then another position uh, at that company. And you can see here now Postaga has uh, found some contacts at these websites. If you don't like the contact that we found, you can click this little plus icon over here and try and reach out to someone else at this website. But these look good. And now Postaga is going to do its thing and analyze each one of these links. Then when we're done, we can click this get contacts button and then Postaga is going to find the contact details for all of these contacts. And once we have their email addresses and names, we can build and send them an outreach email sequence to ask them to link to our article. So I'm clicking get contacts now and Postaga is going to do its thing and try and find email addresses for each one of these different websites. And now Postaga has got us contact emails and information for all these contacts. It'll let us know what the likelihood of deliverability is, which is important so we can reach people's inboxes. Um, and it tries to verify as many of the email addresses as possible. So next up, we choose an email sequence. Now Postaga does come built in with uh, many email templates to choose from based on what kind of campaign you're trying to run. You can always create your own email sequences and templates, but I'm gonna use a skyscraper campaign that we have already built in here. And so as you'll see, the sequence works. First, it sends the first email out, then it'll wait six days and send a follow-up email to the people who did not reply to the first email. And then five days later, it'll send another follow-up email to anyone who did not reply to either of the first two emails. And with uh, outreach and link building, it's important to follow up because just sending one email is going to limit your chances that someone sees, opens, and replies to your message. So an email sequence with three emails is perfectly fine. Uh, so I'd recommend if you're doing skyscraper technique and outreach, have follow-up emails ready to go. And Postaga does it all automatically, so once you set up the campaign, you can launch it, and you don't need to think about it anymore. Next, we get to the email preview section where we can see all of the emails that are going to be going out to these contacts. Now, it'll automatically put in a link to their article so they know what we're talking about, but we have to fill out the merge fields related to our content so that they know where our article is and what we're talking about here. So I'm gonna scroll down and click this little plus icon 
and now we can enter in information about our content. So for our keyword, for example, I'm going to do moving abroad. For this uh, skyscraper new field, I'm going to enter in my blog posts URL. For the skyscraper URL field, I'm going to enter in the other blog posts URL of the website that's currently ranking that they're linking to. And for this summary field, I'm going to just have a little pitch about what my article is about and why it's better. All right. And now I have entered that in. Now, as we can see, all of these emails are personalized for every single recipient with information about my article and why they should link to it instead of the article they are currently linking to. Awesome. And in just a few minutes, we have built out an email sequence with multiple emails to each of these contacts to ask them to link to our article. And when they link to your article, then you'll get more backlinks, which will help you rank better in search and ultimately drive more traffic to your website. So with Ahrefs and Postaga, it's really easy and quick to do this whole process. So next up, once we have that, we can set up our scheduling for when we want this campaign to go out and then click schedule or launch. And that's it. And then we let it do its thing. And there you have it. Those are the basics for how to do a skyscraper technique link building campaign to build more links to your website to help you increase your search rankings and drive traffic, all using two different tools, Ahrefs and Postaga. Uh, if you're interested in more, you can check out Ahrefs.com and also Postaga.com to grab accounts there. If you have any more questions about link building and outreach, please feel free to join our Facebook group. That's Grow Together SEO, Link Building and Outreach. And add your comments below, please, if you have any questions at all or are there any types of link building and outreach videos that you want to see. Thanks so much for watching. Catch you later.